Six man football highlights. One in Division One, the number one team in one in Division One is the McLean Tigers taking on the Petersburg Buffaloes tonight. First quarter, this is the first play of the game. Running back Ben Crockett from McLean is a dangerous man, takes it all the way in, gives the Tigers an early lead. And then first quarter still, next to McLean drive. Crockett drops back, but after scrambling around a bit, he's like, you know what? Like, we already satisfied the exchange rule. Why don't I just take it myself? McLean rolls for a 64-6 win over the Petersburg Buffaloes. Let's stay in six-man football. White Deer, the Bucks, taking on the Nazareth Swifts. 8-2, and two, taking on 8-1. and one. Nazareth, Nathaniel Van Dyke drops back to a pass, and he's picked by John Perlman, and he has reservations for six all the way back for a touchdown, and White Deer is on top late in the game, and Gage Freeman gets, gets the pitch here, and the Bucks are so dang dangerous. They beat the Swifts of Nazareth 70 to 24. Let's go to the bracket 1A Division 1. This is Region 1. McLean rolls on. They they will take on Aspirant next week. Keep an eye on Ira. It's a very good team. They beat Kroll tonight. They will draw White Deer next week. To the city of Happy, happily ever after, for Groom in Perennial Power, Motley County. Oh my gosh. Kyler Deegan will get under it for Motley County. And when it's six-man football, you just got to make six miss. And he was already past two of them, so it was four that missed, and Motley takes the lead. How about a little more from the Matadors? The handoff to that guy again, Deegan, who will breeze past the Tigers' defense for the score. Motley defeats Groom 72-56. to The bride was not happy. There's going to be no oh honeymoon. Oh, my God. Groom... And it was played in happy. Oh my God. There's a lot of jokes there, but I'm going to stay away from it. As we take a look at this region, who do you see advancing? Follett's probably the favorite there, although Whit Harrell is a very underrated team. I like that Whit Harrell team. They will get them next week. That's an undefeated Whit Harrell team. Let's keep it rolling. Win six man football, Trinidad and Calvert, a couple of East Texas powers. This is in Penelope, beautiful Penelope, Texas. James Green will get the pitch here, and he will take it 45 yards. Calvert rolls over Trinidad, 47 to 14. Let's take a look at the bracket. In 1A, Division 2, Region 4, Blanket is through. They beat Panther Creek. Keep an eye on them. Richland Springs is back, and they will get that very good Calvert team next week. Yeah, Richland Springs, Katy, Southlake, Carroll, Salina, the Got only it. teams in state history that have eight state champions. He's not just a head of hair, folks. That's right.